The Mythbusters are no strangers to unpowered flight. I'm very excited about this. Ah, we're starting to lift. In testing the myth of the launch air balloonist, Adam took to the air and took his life in his hands. I have to let you go. Uh, I'd rather just stay under 100 feet. Thank you, over. So they know you can fly beneath weather balloons if you have enough. Here we go! Ah! Wow, look at this. But could a bunch of party balloons really carry a kid away from a carnival? The Mythbusters builders are on the case. At SF Party, they need at least 2,000 balloons, a stack of helium, and a speed lesson in tying. Okay, so you bring two balloons, about the same size, okay, mm -hmm. and you tie them into each other. If Feliciano had a dollar for every balloon he's tied, well, he wouldn't be tying balloons anymore. Feliciano reveals the secret of making really big bunches of balloons. You've got to have columns, lots and lots of columns. All right, so you now my hair. That? Great. You know, I don't usually admit this in public, but I used to be a face painting clown. Oh, uh, <laughs> you know how to tie a little... Balloon, balloon animals? Maybe. Dog with a very long tail. <laughs> beep, beep, beep. Hi. Bye-bye. Don't have too much fun in here. We'll try. I think he just saved us a ton of time. Originally, I had imagined that we were going to tie all these balloons to single strings, each, each balloon having a string going down to a point. But now what we're going to do is we're going to build columns. We're going to make columns of balloons, 250, and then we'll tie those together down to the kid. So it's going to save us a lot of time. Time could really burst their bubble on this experiment. How long does it take to inflate 2,000 balloons? Can you even do it in a day? Time for a time trial. Get set, go! 25 balloons, three sets of hands. This is easy. The clock is ticking and the team is pumped. Come on, Scotty! Two minutes, 20 seconds. For 25 balloons? Okay. Two minutes, 20 seconds. Two that was tough. Minutes. So, say 2,500 balloons means how long? I mean, we've got 25. Two, so that's two. 25. 2,500 times two. That's 1,000 times 2.2. .2. Wait, no, wait, wait. Okay. Look, I can't listen to you guys right now. Two. I got two women. I'm distracted. I mean, I. <laughs> no. Eventually, they called a rocket scientist, and she came up with just under four hours. God, I used to be a teacher, and the kids are going to be like, oh, my gosh, she can't even do math anymore. <laughs> I ain't never been one for book learning. <laughs> math will soon be the least of their worries. Four hours is the absolute minimum inflation time. And they've only got one day to pull this off. It's really not going to be that bad. Famous last words. Yes. Where better to test the fairground balloon myth than an abandoned aircraft hangar? All right, we don't have much time, guys. We've got our balloons, we've got our helium tanks, and we don't have much time. We have to blow up 2,000 balloons and get a four-year-old off the ground by the end of today. Fearless stunt kid Maddie is bubbling over with excitement. Yay! Bubbles! We have bubbles. We're in luck. 2,000 balloons should send Maddie on her maiden flight. <laughs> This balloon business is child's play. Oh, oh my God. So we're doing all right. We're golden. All right, what number are we at? This is going to be 1,900. They're ahead of schedule and with a little luck, ahead of the game in terms of lift. Time for a reality check. What do you got down there, Carrie? Oh, God. To avoid undue wear and tear on Maddie, they'll use a stunt stunt kid. Isn't she cute? She is the exact weight as Maddie. I made her yesterday. Oh, the they'll hook sandbag Maddie onto the balloons. This is fantastic. This is pulling me up so hard. You know, we've, we figured that it would hold up about 10 then, grams per balloon. I, I, yeah, I think we've got more lift than that. I think my arm is about to be ripped out of its socket. <laughs> it's an impressive bunch. But how much lift do they really have? Uh-oh. 
Well, we're not getting lift. 1,900 balloons only cancel out about half the dummy's weight. Oh, you're kidding me. She's still 20 pounds. God, I thought we were getting towards the end. All their lofty calculations have been slapped down by gravity. Are we sure we counted right on the balloons? And Maddie's magical mystery flight is starting to look like an impossible dream. There's a little bit of lift, but not enough. Back at the balloon challenge, young Maddie is showing patience beyond her years. By now, she should have been lifted up, up, and away. But someone's messed up big time. The build team estimated 2,000 balloons would be enough to get her airborne. Yes, this is truly my arm just being lifted by these balloons. Instead, it seems they'll need twice that, and time is against them. Whether it's fear of failure and Mythbusters ridicule. Oh, I need that finger. Or just the dread of a screaming Maddie. <laughs> the builders blow and tie and curse their way towards a balloon bunch of mythic proportions. Well, if our count is correct, we are now at 3,000 balloons, which is about a thousand more than we originally expected. My fingers are toast. I guess we should do another test with the dummy, huh? Once more, a sinking sandbag Maddie reveals the terrible truth. Seven, okay, seven more pounds. We only have to lift seven more pounds. 500 more balloons coming up. <sighs> this myth is starting to smell busted. What carnival balloon vendor in his right mind would create a bunch this big, then hand it to a child? I have never seen that many balloons, not even at the county fair. But try telling that to Maddie, who's been promised a flight. <laughs> get us up to 3,500 balloons. That's a lot of trouble for a little girl and a big myth. But finally, Maddie's moment has arrived. Maddie, it's go time. Woohoo! All right. Safety yeah. line in hand. Wait. I got a safety line. You ready? Yes. Let <laughs> <laughs> like it Maddie will forever be burdened by having a story so amazing that none of her friends believe it. <laughs> it worked! <laughs> That's the price of showing that while you can lift a kid with party balloons, you just need far too many for the myth to be plausible. I would say we popped that myth. Totally busted. There's no way that a circus would have this many balloons in one bunch. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> busted? Did someone say busted? Time to unleash the evil child within. Sure, Freddie and Jason look scary, but for real bang for her buck, Scotty's flashing back to her street performing days. Oh, the humanity. Scotty, I think your method might be the most effective. Remember those balloons set free to roam the world? Well, one bunch turned up at the Sequoia National Park, 300 miles away. The other two, they never write, they never call.